You heard me. I have to find Mummy. in a row I've been on Episangri's duty. When's it gonna end, eh? Soon. People. The hour of the conjuration approaches. But think of Vitalis. Your ordeal is nothing compared to his. Breaking you, I clear your way. The way to the blood of the Chosen One. Today's refining gone. The quality is excellent, but the mass of raw episanguis is decreasing. Our harvesters are being decimated by the rats. Do your best. The life of the Grand Inquisitor depends on the quality of the distillate. Grand Inquisitor is overwhelmed by the bite. I fear it will now attack his mind. Don't worry. The boy's blood will restore the power's equilibrium. May his soul emerge on The distillate is thickening. It will soon be necessary to change the filters and spray the tanks. Twenty barrels. We have almost reached the objective. I hope so. Because that's all we'll be able to produce. It is already a miracle that Vitali's body can hey. take such a I'm afraid. Not afraid. Wait, city during the conjuration. You on the list? Yeah. I'll be on the square in front of the cathedral. Oh, so you'll be right next to the Grand Inquisitor when he frees what? us. What? It can't be. And I'll be stuck here. Oh, well, let's we'll all meet see. again afterwards. The end of the bite. It's going to be quite a party. Just 
an empty space. Oh well. Be brave. Enough. I demand to see Vitalis now. The Grand Inquisitor is very busy. Busy? I am the Archbishop. I represent the Pope. Monseigneur, the mission of the Grand Inquisitor is sacred. His mission was never approved by the Church. I see here only heresy and occultism. And you, you all follow him on this <laughs> infernal... We had... Shut up! Your rank should be more cautious. Mummy, where are you? Oh no, he mustn't see me. Magister, the text clearly mentions the ascension of a child during the Great Plague of Justinian. I knew it. The Roman nobles isolated him from the people and worshipped him in secret. Maybe an ancestor of Hugo de Rune. Continue. They're talking about me. By freeing the country from the bite, the Grand Inquisitor will gain the adoration of the people, and with it, unprecedented political power. Archbishop Gautier's presence here says a lot. The Pope's court is worried. And so they should be. Serves them right for not intervening earlier. Huh? It does seem... The Prima Macula, on the cusp of the first threshold, devours the lost carrier, or walks beside the one who tames it. Master, Beatrice de Rune's research texts are all coded. Chaos. But how can we be sure? They finally moved her to the basement. So she's what? going to crack. What's that? About time. Let's go and take a look. What? Ah. Nothing. Time to move on. Hmm? Do my eyes. 
eyes deceive me? Let's see. So, nothing out of the ordinary here. Grand Inquisitor, the Archbishop has arrived. Perfect. Bring him in. Vitalis. Monseigneur Gautier, I trust your journey went well. Now spare me your niceties. We grow tired of your little game, Vitalis. A game, Archbishop? <laughs> Can a game change the future of the world? Listen to yourself. You have completely lost your mind. And all this is... Uh, if I may, it's important. We have the blood of Hugo de Hun. Have you tested it? Yes. Uh, alas, Monseigneur. The boy should have reached the first threshold already, but it seems something in his blood has slowed the process. The macula is still in its original state. No matter. If the books are correct, my blood and his will be bound. When he reaches the next threshold, I shall reach it with him. Proceed. Enough. You play the matter. But allow me to tell you the truth. You are a vile heretic driven mad by power. The Pope considers you a threat. Vitalis Benevon, you are to be excommunicated. One can excommunicate a man, Archbishop. <laughs> but not a saint. You're over. Meaning that a new era commences. One where puppets such as yourself will kneel and beg me to save them. He is with us. Very good. Go and see whether Beatrice Doreen has regained consciousness. Scary, but I 
have to follow him. Why does she keep resisting like that? We have the same goal. We both fight the plague. Only our methods differ. The daughter is making the same error. Huh? Attention! Nothing. Ad ease. Ad ignem. Ad lucem, sir. So, you saw the Grand Inquisitor? What? Yes. The blood of the carrier flows through his veins. Hmm? The conjuration will take place. Splendid. The end of the plague is nigh. Indeed. But do not lower your guard. What was that? What was that? Odd. Yeah. Huh? Over there. What's... Nicholas, congratulations on capturing the child. We've been after him for weeks. And then he simply turns up here asking to see his mother. Huh. <laughs> it seems he has a sense of humor. That he won't be keeping for long. I have to go and see his mother myself. What's he going to do with her? Captain, uh, I was told that the carrier of the macula is here. Is that right? The child turned himself in this morning. Apparently there was a disagreement with his sister. Uh, As I was telling you, this guard was devoured, but not completely. His bones were cut up and taken away by the rats. For what purpose? To incorporate them into that material we find everywhere. You mean their nests? They use our dead to build their nests. Precisely. And if we do nothing, at the rate the dead are accumulating, the nests will eventually join together to form one giant nest. It's just a matter of time. So let us pray that Vitalis' conjuration ceremony will indeed take place. Where is he? I won't find Mammy without him.
Uh, tell me. Why can't I hear you like the others? Seeing as we have to transport them. You have nothing to fear from them. Meticulous crossbreeding and a little alchemy has tempered their instincts. Not to mention a radical change of diet. <sighs> Good. Hey, kid. <gasps> Help me. No. Help me. What's wrong with him now? Hey, oh, no. die quietly. We're trying to work here. I'd rather he wait a little while. Rats prefer fresh meat. Damn you. You'll all go to hell. You, you and your fucking rats. Nothing at all. Savor this respite. It's going to get mommy. Your death mm. is not an end. For your blood shall nourish a new race of angels. They shall be your children. Your pride. It's horrible. If she sees her son with a knife to his throat, she'll come over it. Lord Nicholas go past. That Darun woman is gonna suffer, I'd say. Ah, serves her right. Ah, such an educated woman. She should have joined our side. Oh, no. She's way too stubborn. But no match for our torture. She must be near. You wouldn't like it out there, believe me. At least here your carcass can still be of value to our alchemists. Think yourself lucky. Oh, bastard. Hey, kid. What the hell are you doing here? Shh. I have to find my mommy. The alchemist. Oh, goodness. You shouldn't. Sorry, I need to go. Goodbye. <laughs> Magistrate Ron. He's talking to mommy. For the last time. Will you answer my questions? Or perhaps you are still upset about what happened to your husband? Right. Our torturer will take care of you. You'll soon have your voice back. Mark my words. Oh no, he's coming back. Hugo? But, but... So they... Amicia said you were dead, but you're not. Amicia? My darling. 
You must go. If they find you here. No. I'm staying with you. Oh, Hugo. Did they take your blood? Oh my god. All right, Hugo. We'll go together. But you have to find the keys. They must keep them in the room at the end of the corridor. Can you make it there? Off you go then. Go. Be very careful. Come back as soon as you have the keys. When I return, I want everything prepared and ready to begin. Do you understand? Yes, Lord Nicholas. All right, you heard him. Everything will be ready. The alchemist will talk. I'm going to enjoy it. Just do your job. The captain of the guard doesn't appreciate improvisation, and neither do I. Uh, yes, of course. Let me know when you're ready. I have to meet the maid. Right. This might get me a promotion. Authority, results. A torture right, has then. to be efficient. That Darun woman no has the skin of a real lady. So soft. Anyway, the knives are sharpened. Hammer, pliers, vibrant saw, everything is ready. Have I forgotten anything? Hmm. With the captain around, let's double check. like lanterns.
I did it. I found myself. Mommy, I did it. Oh, well done. Come quickly. It's all right. Shh. No one will hurt you now. My hero. How do you feel? Your head. It... it talks to me. All the time now. And what does it say? It says... it wants me to join it. The first threshold. Tommy, I'm scared. We'll never get out of here. We don't have a choice. If I am with you, the voice, are you ready to reply? Hugo, can you hear them? Mm, yes. They all have the same voice. The one that makes my head hurt. Don't try to ignore it. Embrace it completely. Don't be afraid. Yes. Everything is all right. Now, you're going to... Well done. You see? My headache's gone. It was the Mercury, but you answered it. Let's get going. loose on the prisoners again. Come on. Find this document and get out of here. A cat. We'll make him leave. Use the rats. No! <laughs> Run, you big coward. You're scared, aren't you? Oh, Hugo, this is not a game. This power is dangerous. You have to control yourself. Yes, Mummy. So, that's my disease. You're not sick, Hugo. It's a... It's a gift. Gift. Ah, you found her. Oh. oh, maybe I'm going crazy. Let's keep looking. Roads are in a terrible state. How are we going to deliver this? All we need now is to lose one of these cages. Be careful. Ah, rat! 
rats! Rat, black rat, fuck! Help! Huh? Something moved. Oh, these roads are in a terrible state. How are we gonna deliver this? All we need now is to lose one of these cages. Be careful. Complicated to explain. But Amicia doesn't know. No. I'll explain later. We had an argument, Mommy. It's all right, my darling. Let's get out of here, huh? So, Beatrice, you are reunited with your son at last. I know what you have done to him. You have taken what you wanted, now let him go. Oh, you insult me, Madame de Rune. Your son is the natural carrier of the macula. And it has not yet finished with him. Which means, neither have I. But this you know. Vitalis, let us finish this. Nicolas, you cannot understand. You feel it as I do. Do you not, boy? We are bound by blood now. What do you think, Hugo? Your family grows larger, huh? I beg of you. I promise to help you, but allow my son to leave. His destiny is not to be a Darun. His destiny is to be here, at my side. You are a monster. A monster? Madame, you have yet to see just how. You don't have a home anymore. You're ours. That's 
God. Not true. You Hear are me. the beginning of the, the conjuration. <laughs> the future depends on you. Why are you doing this? Andra. Why? Leave me alone. Let me go. Hugo, listen to my voice. You have ah. to hold on. You I don't feel. There's a reward for he who kills her. Be strong. The prima macula. It's reacting. Continue! Stop torturing him! I'll tell you everything you want to know! It's too late! Come on! The child is weakening! Yes! Get out! The threshold awaits you! Fast to the other side! No, Hugo! Don't listen to him! Come to me! I'm ready My to son, die! Don't forget who you are! <laughs> That's enough. Hugo, say something. Hugo, can you hear me? Oh no. He is powerful, but he has not reached the threshold as we'd hoped. Do you know why? Amicia. It's Amicia? How tiresome. But he's close now. And we have other pawns we can play. Take her away. Leave him alone! What else do you want? <laughs> A lot more. So much more. And you will stay here with me to make sure we get it. Do not worry, Hugo. I have complete faith. In you, we shall succeed. Oh, Amicia. She's awake! Stay calm, Amicia. You go. Arthur and I tracked you down, but... You disappeared for three days, Amicia. You almost died. We were so worried. You go. Leave me alone. Dreaming. The others must be up. The rats will be coming. We need to light the fires. I won't. Come on! Please open, will you? <laughs> 